Alert! 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 This is not a drill. Blacktober is coming. Starting October 1st, Capybara is hosting an epic, dope, and insane building event in his Discord server. Inspired by Inktober, build prompts will drop every three days around 2 to 4 PST. Got only five minutes? Fine. Got an hour? Even better. Build whatever size with whatever time you have and build wherever you like. But... If you are insanely swag and want trillions of gold stars, you will join the legendary P529's plot server, built specifically for Blocktober. Join the Discord in the description or top of comments. You do not want to miss this insane, fun-having opportunity. Yup, that's right, Cappers. My base got found by this guy right here but we'll get to that in one second uh you see that little intro right there right it's pretty cool um big props to my boy samurai genetics he did a beautiful voice behind that video he just has this beautiful silky sexy voice you know he just it just adds a little bit of flair but besides the point you guys should come join the discord okay we we do the wordle uh, besides the building events that's pretty cool that we're gonna do we do the Wordle in there. I crush the Wordle daily. You know it. And you can post your pets in the pets channel. That's really important. People have posted their pets. I'd say at least there's 12 pets in there. At least 12. Okay. I, I'm not going to not gonna say that. I'm not going to. I'm just a ballpark figure it. Say there's at least 12 pets that you can look at and be like, wow, that's a beautiful pet. But let's get to this guy. Okay. This is Communist Cuba. This guy, he found my base. Well, actually, you know what? He didn't directly find my base. His friend found my base, and his friend, willy nilly, no, I'm just kidding. He he gave the cords to Communist Cuba because he does not play too much. His friend, so uh, we're welcoming Cuba to my base. So uh, hi Cuba. Oh, my animations are really weird. It's like you're actually like flying like Superman. Hi Cuba. Dude. Hello. Would you like to Hello. introduce yourself? I am Communist Cuba, and I am now here. That's correct. You <laughs> are. <laughs> you know what this reminds yep. me. Of? It reminds me of like Nardwar, like interview. Uh, fun fact: I mm -hmm. suck at recording my intro all the time, so we actually did this already. So we did. Yes, yeah, this is the second this is, time. This is actually a fabricated lie that we're doing it right now. Like this is like, like take two. So it's basically like um scripted. And so, what's your next line, Cuba? Uh, this is all fake, and this is all on a creative server. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep. Okay, that's a lie. First of all, I don't have chat on because people are rude in chat. Okay, guys. But uh, are you excited for the base? You excited for the base? I mean, you're a new member. Oh, I didn't even say this, but I am not. I like Cuba. Okay, he's a part of the Astro Brotherhood, which is a group I used to be a part of. Um, that actually, I'm gonna introduce Yoma Boyo later in the episode today. That uh. That he's a part of still and they do uh they do based yep. on 2b2t and i used to be part of i used to build them pretty epic guys all epic and amazing but you know he's family i based with him before he's a cool guy so it's not a bad it's not a bad person to find me and just get that out of the way right away not a not a scary evil griefer absolutely not Never not a scary anyone, in fact mm-hmm well, I find that hard to believe because I've seen you do it before, but we'll put that to the side for now. <laughs> Moral ambiguity aside, are you excited for the base, man? We're gonna we're gonna build epic stuff. I, I mean, am. I'm gonna do I'll... the, but I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do the street up. first. But we're gonna move into mm -hmm. the industrial area. I think I talked about that like seven years ago now. Um, yeah. But we're gonna we're gonna do the industrial area. Are you hyped? I'm hyped to sell. Yeah, can't wait. Actually, I already have something designed for it, so... He does, and it's beautiful, guys. I guess you'll have to wait and see what I cooked up. It's beautiful. We're going to do a whole Communist Cuba hour-long special just to dedicate to him. Because he's just so beautiful and amazing. And the fact that he's the first person to find my base, I mean, that's pretty cool, right? So... Speaking of that, actually, about my base and you being here... See, I made this hotel for my friends, right? And, you know, as yep. you're the first person to find my base, I think you deserve a penthouse suite, right? That's what I heard. Well, I don't know. I heard it was preoccupied by someone already. I don't know if I could be, you know, I already brute forced my way into here. I don't know if I could be now, you know, 
stealing um premium penthouses from other people, can't be. Mm. Bit messed up. So okay. Mind the torches, by the way, these are scary. But Yomo did he was planned, Yomo Boy was planned to have the penthouse, but he's been on he's kind of been coming on my naughty list recently. He's been doing a lot of stuff that's uh really making me upset, you know? Like can't name anything because he's actually a good person, but let's just say you're the new penthouse <laughs> suite owner, okay? Okay. You're fine Let's with it not it. being built yet, though, right? Yeah, no, 100%. I do love my empty penthouse. Okay, well, I don't like that tone, but I'll get to it soon. So... <laughs> well, uh, yeah, thank you for introducing yourself. On with the video. We'll see this guy uh, later on in the series when we do the industrial thing. Not not super soon, but it should be should be in the near future. Down the let's line. Say. Yeah, down the line. Hopefully the base survives. I'd I'd rather have to eh, you know what, I could I could take it or leave it actually. But let's see. You know, we shall see in the future. Yeah. Well, uh Bye, Cuba. I'm going to talk about what I'm going to do in this video now. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. Okay, well, uh, in the intro, I didn't really explain what I'm going to do in today's video, so that's what I'm going to do now. Um, you know, what's on the docket for today? What are we going to do? Well, first off, I've got the mats laid down here for my, my two builds I'm going to do today. But I actually got them because my dupe stash, me and Chicken, my friend's dupe stash... We had around 400 double chests of materials, and it got mostly stolen. Like, I took a little bit of what I thought would be useful for my base, um, and, like, fun stuff. But, um, we mostly, like, it was mostly stolen, and then we gave the rest to our good friend X-Ray Essay for his endeavors. Um, and if I ever need materials, I'm, I can get through friends and stuff, but I, I think that'll be really good for a while. I uh, got all the stuff that I think I need, like glazed terracotta, terracotta, and um, concrete. Concrete is also what I needed. Between episodes, I lit up this area instead of torches. It is now glow lichen and moss carpet with torches. So, ooh, there you, yep, there you see. Um, but you know, just don't look at these little areas, okay? Like, just, just don't, don't, don't worry about those, okay? Like, especially the hotel. I haven't lit it, lit it up yet, but also I'll do when i'm gonna do the interior and stuff it'll be pretty pretty epic do the interior light it all up properly stuff like that instead of just torches but that'll be a little bit down the line maybe in three four weeks i don't know but anyway last episode yeah we built this hotel really lovely do i like it yes do i think it could have been better yes this was built around three to four months ago now which is crazy or like first design three to four months ago and these these builds too um that i'm gonna do today so uh, you know i've met some cool people i've met um this guy mason and j bus and there's some texturing geniuses and they made me realize i suck a little bit of texturing light to dark is a tad boring you know you've got just the kind of shadow with like the the weathering on it right but, you know, I could have added clay, maybe even white terracotta, and maybe even cherry planks to give it, like, some, I don't know, some dynamic kind of saturation and artistic flair. But uh, they maybe want to try to do a little bit more when I texture, so hopefully in the future I can take some ideas from them and stuff from, like that and uh, use my builds going forward. But today, we're going to do, uh, like I talked about, we're going to do one townhouse right here, or you could see the outline kind of where the buildings would be it's gonna be one little townhouse right here um and then one big hotel and i know i know i know i know like i'm actually so dumb right doing another hotel but okay listen listen let me uh, like just let me say, say this okay there's gonna be like a shop on the first floor i'm thinking like a toy shop or something like that so it's basically just like a big building but but like seriously like i'm sorry and uh, more repetition oh my god it's so annoying but like it's fine. It's an epic build, and uh, similar <laughs> similar to Up, it's kind of like there's one building in between two large buildings, which I really like to give it the dynamic feel of like an actual city that's growing and changing. 
<laughs> if you know like the old man's house and up where the two massive like skyscrapers or whatever beside his like small little shack uh the left one is like a brick townhouse with um birch accents mud brick supports or yeah and then the right one is gonna be more of like terracotta spruce and then a copper roof with some mangrove highlights i believe is what i'm gonna do and yeah that's 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 the plan so i mean all i need to do now is get some rooted dirt i literally need to get a stack of rooted dirt but all my materials are accounted for all i need to do is build the thing it's one of these silly transitions i haven't done this in a while where i just wah, boom what was that transition good i think i did amazing i have built both the houses i did it on a stream a twitch stream so uh it was pretty fun. Got to hang out with some some friends, P529, Magic X, and especially Communist Cuba showed up to help build this this uh, these two builds. So props to him, and thanks for my other friends for showing up at the base, and thanks for everyone who showed up at the stream as well. So let's yeah, let's talk about this build. Uh, this one uh, was based off a real building. Um, and I tried to emulate the shapes and stuff using trap doors and these like, mm, I don't even know what you call that. I actually, oh my God, I don't know why I really like this shape here, how this looks. You got like, it's kind of like inset twice. It's really satisfying to me. And it, the building was, it's kind of like, um, it feels very like strong. I don't know. Like I, I really like this kind of vibe. And I'm really happy with the texturing too. I find these colors just mesmerizing for some reason. I'm looking at them just like, this is, I like it. I do quite like it. I don't know why I'm jumping around here. <laughs> um, but yeah, I wanted to emulate the shapes and stuff as best I could. So there's like a million trap doors in this thing. You can see, you have to kind of look at it from this angle. Maybe here. You get the best kind of view of the, um, window frames and stuff like that and that i'm uh, i'm really a fan of and i i still have all these uh these crazy amounts of uh materials down here um for the second building they're pretty nice i uh this is also of a reference photo but this was off a drawing like a sketch someone did and i want to keep like the shapes um but also keep the dimensions kind of or the proportions of the reference photo which I found to be really hard because it was kind of it's kind of tall and narrow, right? But I want this to seem like circle circle kind of thing where it's um where the building isn't just a flat wall, right? You want to add depth to it. But that's kind of hard when it's Minecraft and you want it to be narrow but also tall or like yeah. It's just weird with the kind of proportions that I'm going with. But I'm really happy with the colors of both of these and the little accent pieces like the doors, red and um, like cyan there. And then I didn't even texture the roof yet, but I don't know. I mean, probably just add like prismarine and stuff to that. And it's pretty much good to go. Yeah, I we were talking about Yomo Boyo either last episode or, or the episode before. So uh, I'm going to go wrangle him up and we'll show him off. Or show him the base. I mean, he's seen it before, but, you know, kind of properly introduce him in video format. Okay, so I might have done, like, seven takes already before this. But, uh, where are you there? <laughs> Hi, Omo. <laughs> hey, Cabby. Welcome formally to my base for the seventh time. Thank you. It's my first time here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> so, um. It, it's beautiful for the record. Thank you. Thank you. We're yeah, we're Hold pretty on. good friends and we keep goofing off because uh it's it's quite late. He almost very tired, he's sleep deprived. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I, I don't think his brain is quite screwed on right at the moment, but it's we're gonna true. try to get through this one last time. <laughs> so what are the subjects on our docket here? Number one, here I'll lead. This is my video now. Yeah. So number okay. one, uh you took you gave my house to Cuba. That's my correct. Suite. I will fight him for it. Number two, over here. 
you've got plans over here. I do. It's beautiful. It's it's a great idea, and it's this industrial district. If you would like to talk about it, go ahead. Well, me and you have been talking about it for around six months now. It's been um, a minute. Discussing our ideas, jotting down uh, references and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. So it's finally coming to fruition. It's finally happening. You started designing some builds, and I have too. I have. Well, I designed a copper bridge to lead over to the area, but. So you had this idea of continuing the road onto here. Um, Correct. I got this idea of an industrial area that was kind of built by the more wealthy and uh, the more common folk work here. Yeah. And it's going to have a little bit of lore, but maybe we won't talk about it. Maybe we will. It's got maybe. Some maybe. Beautiful textures, beautiful shapes. And I'm really excited to show everyone. I like shapes. I like textures. So that's good. It's good. <laughs> let's go Minecraft. Um, last thing on our docket um we have the beautiful opportunity um next episode of 2btt we will be touring and haven what and haven what yes you might have wondered if you're a 2btt fan wow what has crowbar been doing all this time well uh we've been bothering him that's what we've been he's been doing mm-hmm so Yomo has made a very insane build that he's going to show off. I did absolutely nothing except for just helping him put it on the server. And we're going to tour End Haven, mm-hmm. which has some of the best builders on the server. This is true. Yeah. See you then. I <laughs> see. See you then. Yeah. <laughs> well, that was good. That was goodbye. Better. Good. Goodbye, Yomo. Goodbye. Okay, bye people. Thanks for watching. That's it. That's it for the video. We did these two houses and we had people come and stop by. So that's that's all. <laughs>